Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. Today we're back in San Bradifax where the tram is working again. I have taken it upon myself to delete the tram. Oh, what's happening now? Oh, why is that happening? Right, oh, oh right, okay, because you're turning round. Right, I see. Oh, okay, so some people are... Right, okay, so some trams can turn round... Excellent. Yeah, after our last disaster, where everything was working absolutely brilliantly up until... I mean, if you just ignore the fact that that's hideously ugly. I mean, yeah, you just just see past that. It's a feature, not a bug. Um, yeah, it, it, uh, every, everything was going really, really well. And then that happened. But uh, yeah, I've taken it upon myself to delete it and start again. Which I really didn't want to have to do, but it seems to have fixed it. So uh, hopefully we're going to get trams running all the... Oh my lord, what's happening now? Oh, why is the same thing happening? This is ridiculous. It just seems to be moving the... Bro why are the trams so buggy? Right, hang on. Pause. Right, we will fix this. Right, everyone just despawn. Or just carry on floating away. You do you. Do you. Uh, we will get this tram to there. Ah, that's why, because we're downstairs. Downstairs, uh, on the ground. Excellent. Right, keep you going... Pair you up. Lovely. Right, have we got... We just could just pop another tram stop it. Right, okay. Ah, right, so if you build it too close to sort of junctions like this... If I build you like that... Where's my, where's my tram stop gone? So that's there, so if we stick you on there... Right, that should work better. Possibly. Or maybe they're just... Oh, no, why has that happened? Oh. See, why is it put another crossover and another crossover? Why can't I delete these crossovers? Like, it, it, why can't I decide where the crossovers go? Why does, why is the, why does the game have to decide? It's very, very strange, isn't it? To be honest with you. And the crossover it said it had put on the bridge is gone. I don't understand. Right, tell you what, we'll take that out, which hasn't helped. Right, okay, we'll, we'll go again. Right, delete. Just, just delete it. Yeah, we'll, we'll, yeah. Go. Disappear. You're spoiling everybody's fun now. Right, there we go. Right, stick you there. Right, can anyone see any crossovers? No, I can't either, you know. So, uh, right, EU tram stop. So that doesn't say it's going to put a crossover in, does it? So if I stick you... Oh, hang on. So we've got... Ah, right, so are these going to be the crossovers? Right, so how about if I stick you there? How's that going to work then? Can I, can I pop you into there? And you into there? How's that working with crossovers? It's working better. Ooh. Right, hang on. I, I can't help but notice a distinct lack of trams. And a hell of a lot of people waiting for... Uh, I mean, to be fair... That seems to be working. I mean, we'll just ignore the, uh, the massive congestion there. The, the trams seem to be working better. Has anyone anyone noticed any disasters? I mean, where... Yeah, there's there's really nothing down here, is there? I mean, there's lots and lots of people waiting for a tram, I'd imagine. Uh, actually, there's not a lot of people waiting at all. They've probably sacked it off and gone and got the bus that we put in last time. I mean, that's got 30 out of 80 on, so there's, there's quite a few. Where's the tram? Just, just a single tram would be nice, you know, just to... Uh, uh, is it because you're waiting your time? Yeah. It does cause a bit of a backlog. Also, it's causing mass traffic. Oh, the trams shouldn't be allowed to park over the road. Why would they do that? It's causing mayhem. There should be a, you should be able to put yellow box junctions down like we have in the UK, where you can't enter unless your exit is... I mean, I don't know why I'm explaining a yellow box junction. Is it, Do people have that at other, other countries in the world? You know, if I said a yellow box junction to an American person, would they look at me like I was mad? I don't know. But you lot can go now, because the the traffic. Traffic lights? Are you just not turning from red at all? Oh, there we go. Ah, it's not that bad. I thought that was another lane of traffic, but that's just parked cars. This is really, really busy, isn't it, with the trams? Tell you what, have we... Uh, I, I noticed there's no trams coming the other way. Please don't tell me it's broken again. Oh no, it hasn't. Wow. It's actually working. Right, is this 
This is the tram line too, so this is actually... Wow, there's people on it. There's people on it. So if we if we nip up here, we'll be able to get people to the uh, to the hub, the commuting hub, the, uh, the the shopping place. I mean, are we just not picking up there? Oh, that's a bus stop. That's why. Ignore me. Tram stops here. Lovely. Right. So we're going round to the left. I still think. Okay, we've had a few bugs with this tram business. But I still think it's a really good way of getting around the Sky Tram. Look, 180 passengers on board. I mean, that's good. I think that has the potential to cause us some problems, but uh, the crossovers are quite close. But look, 183 passengers. Oh, wow, we're a thriving metropolis. That's excellent, right. I mean, we need to do something with this still. I mean, nobody's getting on or off here because, you know, it's knackered. Right, okay. What about a Grand Bridge Automated Parking Building? We've unlocked all the power plants. We could have another water pumping station. Health Institute. Radio Telescope. Emergency Shelter. You see, that would probably work. Hmm. Hmm. How many have we got? 17. See, the space centre is probably not required. Tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to go for the uh, the central bank. Because that's going to reduce the price of imported resources. And the Central Intelligence Bureau. I like that idea. Right, we'll get that in. That tram has dropped everybody off where they need to be. And as far as I can see, no disaster has occurred on the way back. Where's the next tram? Is the, is the one? That's tram line one. I don't know where all the other trams have gone. I mean, they, I mean, they seem to be running, so that's good. I mean, traffic's always an issue, isn't it? This interchange, I mean, look at that. That's working brilliantly. That works awesome. Brilliant. Excellent. Fantastic. How are we doing down here in the industrial district? We're doing actually pretty well, aren't we? For traffic? I can't believe it. Things are flowing. I mean, things down in the city centre bit aren't flowing, but uh, but never mind. I mean, this is just a wasteland, isn't it? I mean, can we can we actually put some housing in yet? We oh yeah, you see, this is still all very. What about if I use my tree gun? Because we learnt how to do that, didn't we? Did, did we? Am I imagining things? Vegetation, yeah, lots of trees. What if I put them in? Hang on, brush strength. Let's go for a hundred percent. Like oak tree. What if we? What if we just sort of? Slam them all in there. I mean, these are all going to get chopped down eventually, aren't they? Although, to be fair, these ones next to the motorway might not. But if we put a lot of trees in, it might reduce ground pollution. That would be good. Wouldn't that be nice if we could just reduce ground pollution a little bit? We'll pop that out there. There we go. If we, if we just slap a load of trees around here, that might soak up a bit of the mess that, I mean, let's face it, I made. It might also help with the air pollution if there's lots of trees. Well, not help there be more air pollution. You know what I mean. Help reduce the air pollution. There we go. I like this sort of tree gun. You can just fire trees everywhere. It's awesome. Right, how about a few few birch trees just to sort of break it up a little bit? You don't want the same tree over and over again, do you? There we go. I'll stick you round there. Lovely little uh, bit of that. I mean, these are obviously going to grow bigger, aren't they? I mean, we planted loads of little trees like this here, and they've all sort of got bigger. I mean, at the minute, they're all they're all little, aren't they? Diddy trees. What about wild green bush? Just to uh, just to fill that out. Lovely. I mean, this is all going to be housing eventually, isn't it? Let's face it. But uh, but yeah, we'll just try and reduce that ground pollution. It also makes it look a bit nice around the motorway, doesn't it? Just while we're waiting for that to happen. I don't know if it's actually written into the game mechanics that, that lots of vegetation will improve the uh, the pollution side of things, but you'd sort of imagine so from a real-life stance. There we go. Right, okay. How we... Uh, yeah, that's good. Ooh, BNSF. Right, okie dokie, that's good. Because I, I want to... Uh, oh, what's this? We can unlock 36 more tiles. Wow. That is, uh, that is quite a lot of tiles, isn't it? Shall we continue over on University Island? 
I reckon we should, you know. There we go. We'll uh, we'll carry on over here. There we go. Purchase that so we can expand around there a bit more. And we'll also go for a bit more around here. You can actually click and drag, can't you? I, I know this. There we go. We've used 20 out of 20 permits. So we can now do a lot more over here. I mean, what have we got here? This is... This would be good for our, uh, our sort of industry side of things, wouldn't it? Issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive. Hmm. And try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. Oh, it's in this the budget, is isn't it? Where's the Where's the money side of things? There we go. So, You're production. So, we are in a de deficit. We could actually do a lot with that, with the, this all this, this wood over here. Because it doesn't actually... It doesn't cause that much pollution, does it? So, if we, if we go for the zoning... Specialised industry. Right, we could actually produce a lot here. Right, tell you what, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll go... Go for a little road. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather wait now we're in traffic than to have to start thinking about everything all the time. Besides, if I did that, I'd never get right, anywhere. Right, where's the... And there we go. Main feature story. The commercial district is booming. Lovely. As the area is attracting more high-end stores, bringing the latest... Right, so if I, if I do a bit of that... You can now shop for designer shoes while sipping a fancy local Jarva mug. Lovely. Right, we'll stick a roundabout in. That's good for business. It's a big roundabout. Right, there we go. Thanks, right, okay. So if we uh, if we go to the go for a bit of that, ooh, look at that. You see that's gonna work. Oh, hang on. I don't think I meant to do that, but never mind. We're we're rolling with it. Right, there we go. Right, up to the roundabout. Yeah, lovely. Oh, I like how you can snap it to the road. That's brilliant. Right, there we go. Just keep it. Keep it going, yeah. Right, distance is too long. No, the distance is not too long. Oh, because the the circle doodars here. Is there no way that you can make it like curve? It'd be so much easier. There's a lot of uh, harvestable resources. And if we snap you to the. Uh, where's the building? There's the building. Right, there we go. Lovely. Right, that's. That is all good. I mean, to be fair, it's. Probably not going to have electric, is it? Electricity or water? No. Right, so if we if we just sort of do that, that's going to work, isn't it? And then what I'll do, because a lot of electricity going on around here, there's going to be a lot needed, isn't there? I'm going to, uh, for all this industry, we'll just stick you to there. There we go. So you can provide the electricity. And then, uh, can we get a bit more... Bit more production going on. I'm gonna pop you there, and we're just gonna do exactly the same again, but this way up. There we go. Right, yeah. There we go. Yeah, lovely. We can actually tap the snapping off. That might make it a bit easier. I mean, this isn't gonna have as many uh, harvestable resources, is it, as the uh, as the other section? Oh, maybe. I don't know. It's got quite a bit. It's still above the 3,000 mark, so uh, yeah, happy with that indeed. Right, okay. I'm going to bring you... Right, hang on, where's the overlapping items business? Right, stick you there. Lovely, yeah, that's lovely. Right, we'll just bring you round the roundabout. And then straight back up to, up to there. Look at that, right. That's good stuff. And then how about one of you... One of you there. Yeah, lovely. I mean, this is just going to be a money earner, isn't it? We want to use the space efficiently. And we've got this natural resource, so we may as well use it. I'm thinking maybe we could sort of do away with this. We could put this here, and then we could do away with the, uh, the wood... It's a bit close to the city centre, couldn't we? Because we are still producing wood there. That might make it a little bit nicer. And nobody actually needs to know that this isn't forest. You know, it's only us that knows that, isn't it? Oh, we've unlocked a paper factory. Wow. Okay, we could put that down. We could put that in this area, couldn't we? Right, tell you what. We'll leave a gap like we did with the farming. We'll go for like a woodland walk type thing between the, uh, between the circles. 
Right, hang on, where are we? There we go. Right, bring it round. Still above the 3,000 ton mark for the production, so that's good. Right, bring you up there, up there, and yeah, look at that. So we've got two massive circles. And to be fair, from a distance, it still looks awesome. What are we doing regarding the uh, the employees? The employees are good. What have we got there? Still uh, 33 out of 40. Would be good to have some sort of bus service, wouldn't it? Connecting. See, I, I do want this to sort of remain a bit more out of townish. I don't want it to sort of absorb into the main city. But obviously, you need to have. I mean, right, where's that? Where's that paper factory? Uh, right, paper factory. Ooh. Wow, that's enormous. Right, okay. That's not going to work, is it? Does it produce a lot of pollution? Ground pollution, medium air pollution. Oh, right, okay. It's a bit annoying. I don't really want that blowing over to University Island. So what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll bring this round here. And there we go. Right, make that straight. And then we'll, we'll sling the... Uh, yeah, you see, that's going to work quite well, isn't it? We'll sling the paper factory on there. The ha! There we go. Look at that. Why can't you get out there? You you can. There's there is car access. You can you can see it there. Okay. Obviously you can't. Is it because it needs to be there? All right. This is a disaster. Right. How do we sling you on there? Love. Oh right. Okay. That works better now. Right, are you... Oh, right, you require timber, which is produced here, I imagine. Is is that what this is making? No, it's making wood. Oh, dear. Right, hang on. There he has paper factory. Oil refinery, vehicle factory. This is... A, right, okay, hang on. I need to stop saying this is a disaster. But how are we how are we making you see that's that needs timber, doesn't it? But is Is timber wood? Well I know timber is wood, but like does the wood how do we make the wood into timber? Hmm. I feel like I'm being particularly thick with that one. It's not the end of the world, it's it's quite a there we go. Oh hang on, I didn't mean to do that, right. Right, bring the bring the road, yeah. Curvy road, lovely. There we go, we'll bring that up there. Lovely. I should really have this being produced sort of over in the industrial district, shouldn't I? We could actually do that. So if I uh if I go and make a big road, right, hang on, where are we? There we go, right, up there, yeah, lovely, massive road. Right, let's go for some of these other industrial buildings that I've not built. So, fuel plant. That's looking good. Excellent. Right, we'll sit you there. A switch on. This factory makes everything that runs on electricity, right? Oh, wow, these are enormous. They're so big. Can we actually make these bigger? No. A farmer. Ooh, that's scary. Right, big farmer. Right, stick you there. Tell you what, actually, no, don't. Right, delete that. There we go, right, we'll bring you down there, and then we'll stick the farmer. Because we've not used any of these buildings, have we? We'll, uh, we'll pop you there, and then the oil refinery, which, let's face it, is massive. Well, it would be, wouldn't it? So what does, what does this actually do? So if we... There we go, so it... Oh, it doesn't actually produce anything. This building is empty and available for rent. I don't understand. Oh, okay. So, that's alright, because that's... Pharmacy requires chemicals and pharmaceuticals. Petrochemicals. Oof. Right. Are we producing enough wood now, if we go on the, uh, on the production? Whoa, grain, we have a massive deficit. Why have we got so much deficit in the old grain situation? Is that because I've... Right, okay, yeah, I think I might have ruined everything there by demanding a lot more grain. Whoa, we really do need to make more grain. Right, okay. I mean, it's going to be costing us a small fortune, isn't it? Where is fertile land? 
let's uh, let's have a little look at the old natural resources. Right, that is going to have to be farmland around here then, isn't it? Right, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to go for the uh, the normal road. And then we'll just go sort of up through the middle of it. There we go. Yeah, we're, we're going to have to spend some time actually doing a bit more on the industry side of things, aren't we? Tell you what, right. Sling that there, because we can actually do something with this now, can't we? Right, tell you what, where's the road meant to go? It's meant to go there, so I'll I'll build you there. There we go. Lovely. Right. Excellent. So you are going to go up to there. Lovely. Right, okay. We'll just sort of build that around the edge. It's going to be the sort of weirdest looking farm you've ever seen in your life. It's going to come up here. Yeah, build you around there. Uh, right, hang on. Yeah, out to there. So I'll build you to the river. Yeah. Is it grain that we're building as well? I forget. Right, out to the top. Lovely. Yeah, round the edges there. Excellent. That's a lot more. A lot more grain to be produced. It does look a bit of an odd shape, I grant you, but uh, but we're gonna we're gonna make it look relatively decent. Right, there we go. We'll keep you keep you like that. Lovely. Right, bring you in there, because obviously this is where it gets quite finicky. There we go. Excellent. Right, bring you to the side. go, bring you round there, plenty of farm to be had. See, it's only 307 tonnes, I still need another like 9,000. That's insane, we're going to really need to do more with farming, it's an area that we have neglected quite a bit, but it's fine. Right, okay, hang on, because that's not going to work until I've done this area, is it? There we go. Right, bring you down there. I'm going to stick you there. Right, 403 tons. That's absolutely fine. Right, okay. Same again. Grain farming. I'm going to put a, a smaller farm on there. Because that's fine, isn't it? Right, so he's going to... That's going to go to there. Yeah, lovely. Because the other farm sort of does exactly the same thing, doesn't it? Like, with the... You know, because it's got that area in between, hasn't it, where the, the sort of water comes from. So if I sort of do that... It sort of does that thing there, doesn't it? So I could, I could have, like, a little path running down here, a bit of foliage around the side. It might actually make it look quite good. Or, what we could do is have a couple of... You see, that's... A couple of them... Just by the, just by the side there, makes it look a bit more and like a path to them. Can we, can we go underground? Yes, we can. There we go. Right, there we go. One, two, three. Because if the farming can produce its own electric, then that will be awesome, wouldn't it? There we go. We'll have you running under there, and then you can, you can run under there. So that they don't, you know, they don't become bottlenecked, do they? Lovely. But it just sort of makes it look a bit more, a bit more like that. Lovely. Right, okay. Need another farm. I mean, have we, have we tackled the, uh, the production thing? Yeah, okay. We're, we're definitely more on it than we were. Right. How's the uh, how's that looking? So I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for a bit of a dirt track, sort of from there, like that. Oh Christ, what's happened now? Who's got blackouts? Everything's fine. 
There's nothing wrong with it. There's absolutely nothing wrong with it. Stop panicking. She's panicking everyone, isn't she? She doesn't need to. Right. So, I'm going to go for a bit of... Right. There we go. Right. I'm going to put a farm there. Right. I'm going to bring this farm... Round there. There we go. Right. Bring that round. But let us not tarry. Mm, there we go. Ah. This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about hitting the streets, you can expect delays. Right, there we go. And another one. Good to know, Jim. Seems like everyone is in a hurry to get somewhere fast. It's worth slowing down. And if you can, right, there we go. Right. Look outside the rush. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather wait an hour in traffic than to have to start thinking about everything all the time. Besides, right, there we go. Yeah, farm, get farm, farm, farm. Oh, look at that. See, that's going to look good with a little path in it, isn't it, maybe? Can we do the, uh, the exact same again on the other side? Yeah, we probably can, actually, can't we? I mean, could we, could we fit it all in one? No, we're not going to be able to do that, are we? Right, tell you what. Stick that farm there. Yeah, lovely. How about if we if we do a bit of that and then we can have a little farm? We'll bring you to there, lovely. Oh, that doesn't look. There we go, right, lovely. So bring you down to the road, across. And then we'll just do the same again with a little little bit of little path between lovely right we've you we've exhausted all that area there haven't we and to be fair we've reduced the demand or the deficit sorry we've reduced the deficit by about 2000 now obviously that's not going to fix it we're still going to need to do that but what it means is we're producing excuse me we're producing more now some of these are at 111 100 and whack <laughs> excuse me um, right, the farm is actually producing quite a lot then, isn't it? So that's that's a good thing. Now, uh, what are you actually doing? Are you... Wow, you can employ a hell of a lot of people. That is insane. That's, that's absolutely insane how many people you can provide. I mean, we could definitely do with the bus coming down here, couldn't we? Like a little little shuttle bus from this station just you know sort of round here can we i don't know you see well have a little turn around will it just a just a bus turn around there we go right there we go bus stop shelter and another have another out there because then people can get to the paper factory quicker. How about this then? Another couple outside the wood. That might actually work really well for a little shuttle bus. And then this can just go down to the station. Uh, there's not really anywhere for it to turn around, is there? We could bring it down to the tram. There we go. It could go round. It could not go around because that's tram only. We're going to say it could go around the loop, but it couldn't. Uh, right, tell you what we'll do. We will bring... I don't know what we're going to do. We'll put another loop. Right, we've got nothing there, have we? Right. See, why can't you put a bus stop on a bus on the road? It's very odd, isn't it? Right, we'll do that then. So, if we go a new line... Create a new route. Going to go from the high street up to there. Yeah, same stops as the other route. It's going to go round to there. I don't think we'll need that many, but you just never know in this game, do you?
Right, you're gonna... Oh, it's there, isn't it? So you're gonna go around there. Complete line. Excellent. That's really good. Right, well, that is where we are gonna leave it for today. I do hope you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, do click the like button. It's always appreciated. And uh, if you haven't already, do consider subscribing so that you never miss out on any future episodes. I need to make sure that we've actually got enough vehicles. Right, okay, we're gonna need more vehicles. Excellent. Maybe a new bus garage at some point. We'll uh, we'll make sure we do that in the next time. Yeah, any suggestions, I want to hear them in the comments section. I can't promise that I will actually be able to action all of them. But, uh, oh, why are the... Why are there moose in the road? What? But... Do they affect anything? They don't seem to be. Oh, I don't know. Right, cheers so much for watching, everybody. And hopefully, I'll see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.